LA traffic, man. There's no getting around it. Glad I caught you before we came in. We just landed this. It's a capital case. You have experience with those? Well, we handle quite a few. All right. Well, I'll make the introduction, then I'll bow out and you'll stay. Okay. I looked up that prison overcrowding case you and William worked on. Which one? This one was against Men Central. You prevailed? Oh, that was overturned. Yeah. How's your big plea reform brief going? Uh, put it aside. Well, tell me more about it. I'm interested. Carry it as far as I can take it. Well, how about some help? I mean, I've, I've been thinking about it. I've become less skeptical about the possibilities and scope of what you said. I could devote office resources. I could help you complete the brief. We could file it at the federal court together. That's just the first step. It's going to take years of commitment to see it through. Well, commitment doesn't seem to be a problem for you, Roman. I hear you're moving to a new apartment. How'd you hear that? Payroll check comes across my desk. I know that building. It's, uh, it's not cheap. Well, uh, I had money saved. No, I mean, it's great. It's a nice building. Well, I mean, I had money you know, saved for a long time. Well, what else is it good for? <laughs> you got your ID? Yeah, yeah. George Pearson, Roman Israel, to see our client, Carter Johnson. Carter Johnson? Well, yeah, I meant to tell you, they, uh, they picked him up on Friday from the Ellerbee case. We've been retained. This is my associate, Roman Israel. Roman is a devoted advocate and a fabulous attorney. I mean, he's going to be the point person on your team. He's good, huh? Well, he's better than good. Have you had a chance to review the fee structure? The stuff he sent over. Yeah. Yeah. You understand this is a capital murder case? Yeah. All right, first off, you want to be fully up to speed on your file. You'll uh, make better decisions if you're completely informed about every aspect of your case and you know all your options. I know all my options. Well, unfortunately, we uh, can't change what's been done. And that means facing this head on. I think you understand that the penalties you're facing are very severe. An overview, we're going to study the discovery, the evidence the prosecution gives us. And we're going to force the prosecution to give us anything and everything we want. Ron, you want to step in here? Uh, yeah, we're going we're gonna to perform a private investigation and uh, devise a defense. That's not all we're going to do. We're going to outwork the prosecution. We're going to have work, we're going to have perform them. I'm going to get you the best result possible. Life in a cage. Well, that's the outcome we're fighting. And that's going to be a long process, and it's going to cost quite a bit of money. So with that in mind, I, I'd like to suggest that there's no need for two billable attorneys at this early phase. So if it's OK with you, I'm going to bow out. I'll let Roman continue. It's OK with me. All right, Carter. I'll be in touch. And I'll speak with you later. OK. Guard! The, um, uh, prosecutors are going to favor a grand jury over a preliminary hearing, which will allow them to wait and uh, reveal your evidence at the trial. You represented Durrell. Uh, briefly. I asked for you after talking to his celly. We have a number of illegal maneuvers we can employ and try and force a prelim. I don't care about the prelim. I'd advise that we pursue it. You knew where I was. When was that? Before they picked me up. I'm sure Darrell shared that information with a number of people. No. You're the only person he told. That's what he told the guy. You called it in, collected reward money. You fucked me. I presented myself on your request for an attorney. You talking, but it don't mean nothing. I ain't never getting out of here. They got me cold. But I tell you this, I got you anytime I want. Guard. guard. Any place. Guard. Could have already done it. Guard. But I want you to be where I am. Guard. Thinking about it. God! Just go and tell somebody what you did. I want out! Broke your own law. Privileged information. God! Don't tell them about the law you broke. I'll throw you in here with me. But you're gonna run. Try it! <laughs> 